Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So as you can tell by the title of today's video, this is going to be a leggings haul. So for today, I wanted to choose a few pair of leggings that were on the lower end as well as on the higher end. So going to be going over price and quality of the leggings, if they're worth it or not, so that you can decide which brands to go with for the perfect legging for working out. We're going to get into that soon, but I also want to say that this video is sponsored by Sparrow Water Bottles, which is a fabulous water bottle company. To give you a little bit of insight into Sparrow, they have a bunch of different types of water bottles. This is one of them. They come in literally every color imaginable. Of course, I picked pink for one. They are completely insulated, so you can have 12 hours of super, super hot liquid and 24 hours of super cold liquid. I love this one because this is really cool, it's like a wooden top, but all the tops are interchangeable. So they also have water bottles with straws as well. So you can interchange the top here, obviously different sizes too. Clearly I like really bright colors. They have monotone as well. And then the last one that I chose, this bottle also has just kind of a standard top too. So really like that they're sort of customizable in that Depending on how you want to drink out of it, you can either be a straw person or this is a smaller mouth hole and then the pink one is a larger mouth hole. So different sizes as well, anywhere between 12 ounces to 32 ounces. I love these water bottles. They're great for on the go, great for when I'm leaving and going to work out somewhere. If you want to check out these water bottles, they are on Amazon so you can literally get them tomorrow. I'll put the link below. Thank you to Sparrow for sponsoring this video. With that, let's get into the leggings. Okay guys, so leggings number one here. These are the cheapest leggings that I'm going to try on today. They are $12 from BP in Nordstrom's. So I wanted to show these to you because in terms of look, I am obsessed with these leggings. They're so flattering. They fit perfectly. I think they're super flattering on the glutes as well. So I would say overall look and feel and fit, they're great. Are they squat proof? Absolutely not. They're not squat proof. They're not run proof. These are 100% fashion leggings. Every single time that I think I'm gonna try to look cute and go to the gym in these, it fails because I'm pulling them up. I am trying to run and as I'm running, I'm trying to pull up my pants, which nobody wants. They're a little bit see-through from behind, so I think for sure you cannot really squat in these. So like I said, I mean, they're literally $12. They're so flattering. So if I'm just gonna go out in a pair of leggings, I'll throw these on. They go with everything because they're black and they fit super nice, but functionality is like a one out of 10 max. I mean, they won't like fall off, but I think you're looking for a legging that you can actually work out in. These are not them. So like I said, $12 worth it if you want a cute pair of leggings that fits good, looks good, will match with anything, but they will not stay up. They're obviously a little high rise on the sides, but kind of low here, you can literally see my belly button. So that you guys can see the full legging, I backed up a little bit here. So you can see, I mean, like I said, they're not my go-tos, but they are really flattering. They hit about at ankle for me. I'm gonna move on to the next ones because these are not my go-to leggings. <laughs> Okay guys, so this next pair of leggings is from the company Stronger, and I really like these leggings actually. The company has matching tops to their bottoms, so if you like the leggings or you're like a set type of gal, you can wear the top as well. I have it, but for simplicity's sake and to focus on the leggings, just wearing plain black. I love the look of these. These are super fun. There's some toned down ones as well. But if you like really cool, fun colors, they have like superhero ones. Really, really cool company. I will say overall, these are a bit more spandexy. The ones that I was trying on before were definitely more of a casual legging. So these are much more suitable to working out. I really like how they fit. They're super high waisted up here. If you turn around, you can see the back as well. Really cute. Not the most flattering, in my opinion, at least on my glutes, just because I feel like it doesn't have a defined line. And I feel like that's what actually makes your glutes look good is when it can kind of rise up. Not super annoying and far, but just enough. So I don't know that I love it on my butt, but in terms of functionality, if I'm not really caring about what I look like and just want to go to the gym and have a really good workout, these are awesome. They're definitely squat proof. I can absolutely run in these. They'll stay up. I don't have to worry about it. 
My only complaint, and this isn't even a complaint for these leggings, but just like leggings in general, is that they don't have pockets. I'm just like a big pocket gal. I love to be able to have my phone in my pocket while I'm lifting. But in terms of functionality, these are perfect. I really do like these leggings. They run at about $79. So I dropped from $12 leggings to $79 leggings. There is a huge difference in the quality. You can definitely tell. Like I said, the first ones you cannot work out in. So I don't know that I would necessarily buy another pair for $79 just because they don't fit quite right, in my opinion, in the glutes. But overall, great legging and the style is so cute. Okay, so these next leggings are aloe leggings and I'll be honest, I actually don't know much about the aloe brand. I bought them from Saks Off Fifth and my friend had told me that they were super nice expensive leggings and they were on sale. So these run, I believe, around $108. I don't know exactly what I paid for them. Definitely not that much, but I looked online and these looked and seemed comparable to some of the ones that ran about $100 plus. So I will say fit-wise, these are absolutely the best fitting leggings. And by that, I mean they just snug and they hug everywhere. I actually don't love where they ride. I think they ride a little bit low and I just really like when my leggings are super high-waisted much more flattering. I don't think very many people can pull off low-waisted pants, especially when you're working out. This is a really cool material and fabric. It's actually a mesh and it's mesh all the way up through here and then all the way down through the leg. Really annoying to get on. They're super tight at my ankles and really hard to ride up. I actually haven't worn these that much, so I don't know if the mesh would begin to give out if you overused these unclear. I don't use them enough to know, but it is annoying trying to get them on. I will say I don't love how they fit on my butt. I think they flatten it out quite a bit. So for an $108 pair of leggings, I want my butt to look phenomenal. And I just don't think that these do that for me. So overall, definitely expensive, good quality, but I would not say that these are my favorite. Now, every single company has different leggings, right? So these could suck and then another pair could be amazing. So I don't know enough about the Aloe brand to say an overall synopsis of how I feel about the brand. But these ones I don't love other than the fact that they're really cute and I get a lot of compliments on them because they're super different and they're pretty fun. So I saved my favorite leggings for last, which I actually have tried on in my original leggings try-on haul, which I will paste below so that you can go check that out as well. There's a few other legging types in there too. So these are my absolute favorite leggings. I think they are so flattering. They also have pockets, so I feel like I'm super biased and the other ones really couldn't compare because they didn't have pockets. So these are my Booty Queen. Booty Queen, if you're watching, like, sponsor me, I love you. <laughs> Look. But seriously, I do love these leggings. They obviously, like I said, have pockets. So if you're working out, especially if you're lifting, it's so nice to be able to just put your phone in your pocket and not have to put it on the floor where you're working out or whatever. And I just like how high-waisted they are. They fit really well. And if I turn around, <laughs> these are the best leggings when it comes to fitting on your glutes. I don't know how they achieved this, but I feel like the shaping here just makes it look like you have that like shelf look for your glutes. I cannot say enough good things about these leggings. I feel so confident in these. I absolutely adore these. So these run for 90, which I know is on the expensive side. However, I will say they are always having deals. So if you go online, like right now, these are actually on sale for 30. They're sold out, so that kind of sucks. But there's other ones on sale for 60, for 50, all over the place. So if you check back and you keep looking, they will go on sale. Now one caveat to that is, these have been the only leggings that I have loved from Booty Queen. There are some other ones that are nice as well, but they're not quite the same material. So I'd say these are a combination between the original leggings that like casual wear and the spandex. So they're not super spandexy. They kind of feel like pajama pants, honestly, which is why I love them as well, because I will lounge in these all day. So food for thought. But if you like any of these leggings or want to check out these sites, I'll put them below. 
I'll try to put the exact legging, but some of these are sold out, they're a little bit old. So I'll put whatever is similar and you guys can go and check them out in the description. Thanks for watching you guys. If you liked any of these leggings, I'll put all of the information in the description below as well as if you want to get yourself a cool water bottle, that'll be down there too. So all the links that you need below, go check out my other legging haul video as well or any of the other hauls that I have. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you next video.